Hello, this is King Kong Nihon Automation Training Lesson. And in this video, I will show you how to create this mode, just a group country in KCS firmware, so that you can turn on and turn off some loads together. Okay, let's look at how to do with it step by step. And now let's look at this is King Kong AIO hybrid. Uh, uh, I use this take a demo of the video. Uh, this has five channel relay. And in this video, I will show you how to country some relays, such as one, two, three, three relay on and off at the same time, uh, just by creating the sense mode in KCS, and also update to Home Assistant by MQTT Auto Discovery. And also, you can use the sense mode for different uh, controller, can call it controller. Okay, let's look at my computer. And this is KCS firmware, uh, AIO hybrid. And you can see the monitor, ADC, DAC, sensor, and IF input, IR input, and IR output, and RGB LED strip, and digital input, and digital output. And this uh, every resource that only have uh, uh, one unit uh, to control, uh, such as this relay output, just by on and off, just for one relay, one unit. So we need to create a sense mode and create a group country by different multi relays at the same time. So let's look at how to do. We can go to this if ddt and just monitor the if ddt command as before. But this time the new version that you will see this have a sense mode uh, enable and disable. So this will be very use, useful and just select which then command that will make a group and add to the monitor web page. Let's look at if DDT. For example, I want turn on relay one, two, three at the same time. So I can create this on one, two, three, just uh, for this, this thing's more name and enable this if DD command and enable the things mode. I can create the DO is one, two, three, just by this way, one, two, three, for on, apply. And this time you can see, I don't add this if condition because I only want this then command list work as a things mode. So you just enable this one. So you don't need to add this if condition at this uh, left window. So you can press save and okay. And after reboot, then we can go to this monitor web page. And now you will see this have a things mode that called on one, two, three. So you can see I can press this button. And you can see this relay is on. So this is the things mode. We can turn on one, two, three relay at the same time. And also you can see this state is update. We can turn off. And also you can create another FDD command. You can see. I can edit and this is off one, two, three. I just off enable and the sense mode. And this time the digital output, I just fill this off uh, one, two, three. Apply and save and OK. And let's back to the monitor web page. Monitor. And this time you can see this have created the second sense mode. This is off one, two, three. You can see, click, turn on one, two, three at the same time. And click and turn off one, two, three at the same time. So this is group country relay one, two, three and on and off. And also we can look at the home assistant. You can see the home assistant, because I have set this uh, protocol generate is home assistant auto discovery. Uh, I have filled this MQTT Moscute part and the username and the password. So this all hardware resource in the monitor will update to home assistant. Now I can look at the home assistant and look at the setting and the device and the device. I, imp I have input AIO hybrid. You can see that is auto discovery by Home Assistant. And you can see uh, this all can update the results from the AIO hybrid. And you can see 
I can turn on, turn off manually, and you will see uh, this two button is six mode from this. Just this two button on one two three and off one two three. You can see I update to Home Assistant. I'm not config anything. The other code for Home Assistant, but it will auto discover. So you can see I can press this on one two three. In Home Assistant, that can control this really one two three. And press off one two three button, and you can see the Home Assistant also can work at the same time with the KCS firmware. You can see I can turn on one two three. You can see one two three and turn off, turn off one two three. Okay, so this is very useful. You can see just in if ttd command, you can add this then command, and if you want. Use a one button, this small button to control different King Kong relay board. You can just use this custom size protocol so that you can set this command to different relay controller by different protocol, uh, such as you can buy network and by Ethernet or by Wi Fi or by IS485 model bus protocol. So you just create your custom size protocol and add to this Zen command at here so that. You can use the sense mode to send the different command to different controller. Uh, they, they will work at the same time. Okay, if we have any questions, you can leave a message to us. Thanks for watching.